SpaceX is targeting tonight, Thursday, December 28th at 8.07 p.m. for the launch of the Falcon Heavy rocket for the USS F-52 mission from Launch Complex 39A at Kennedy Space Center. And this is a really secret mission. The Space Force has a space plane in the fairing of the Falcon Heavy. We don't know exactly what orbit it's going to go into. We don't know what kind of uh, instrumentation that this has, but we do know that it's an observatory space plane. It's, that's all we know at this point and maybe some other things, but we don't know exactly what it does. It's never been disclosed. It's top secret. So this is a pretty cool mission and I want to share some things with you about the mission. So we're going to talk about a few things. SpaceX, of course, has some interesting things to talk about on their X account. Falcon Heavy vertical on the pad. Absolutely incredible. This thing is massive. This thing is gigantic. Beautiful shots on the pad from SpaceX. Falcon Heavy vertical at the pad in Florida ahead of tonight's launch of USS 52. Okay. Now we have this from SpaceX officially, 8.07 p.m. So get ready for that December 28th. But they do have a backup time available at 8.06 p.m. Eastern time on Friday, December 29th. And this will be the fifth launch and landing of the Falcon Heavy side boosters, according to SpaceX, which previously supported the USS-44, USSF-67, Hughes, Jupiter-3, and NASA's Psyche mission. Now, the boosters will separate. It's an absolutely amazing thing. And when the side boosters separate, they land back on Earth. The center booster will not separate, um, or it will not land, I should say, back on Earth. It's going to be expendable and drop into the ocean because apparently it's going into a very high orbit and they have to thrust this thing for a while before it gets to that certain orbit. So they can't land it. It won't have enough fuel to land. So they're just going to dish it into the ocean. And they won't try to recover that booster. So we have a few other things here. The Space Systems Command for uh, U.S. Space Force standing by for launch of USS F-52 and the X-37B mission this evening using a SpaceX Falcon Heavy rocket at Kennedy Space Center. Another beautiful shot. Space Force, you have great photographers, by the way. <laughs> Whoever took this photo, good job. That's great. And then we have uh, a little bit of information about the weather. We have to go over the weather because this is the only thing that could probably stop this launch tonight is if the weather is just bad, but it looks like it's going to be good. It's at 80% good right now. So it has a 20% chance of not being good. Primary concerns are cumulus cloud rule. So what that means is that if there are too many clouds, um, if, if there's any showers, they may develop ahead of uh, the launch. Then SpaceX may scrub the mission because it's dangerous to launch a rocket through rain. It's more dangerous than not dangerous. So um, basically static electricity and lightning, things like that could damage the rocket. And they don't want to do that because they have a very precious cargo, very top secret cargo, and they can't, they can't do that. So um, they can't risk it. So there might be some wins, um, but let's take a look at what the actual weather from the Space Force says. An area of low pressure off the coast of the Carolinas will slowly move northeast through the day as a weak and wave, excuse me, a, wave, a weak wave located in the Gulf of Mexico will move eastward across the central and southern portions of the state, bringing some spotty showers overnight and into Thursday morning. Much of the upper level moisture associated with the wave will move off the coast by midday, leaving only top, uh, low top showers along the front to the west by the launch window. So maybe they have like a little bit of a isolated shower chance, um, but mostly cumulus cloud rule is what they're going to be looking out for tonight. And I know I'm not, a, I'm not a, um, it's not really exciting to talk about the weather for most people, but this is exciting because if the weather doesn't cooperate, SpaceX may have to scrub this mission and not launch this top secret thing tonight. So let's talk about the top secret thing. Should we? The top secret space, it's a space plane on top of, on top of a rocket. Like this is incredible. So this is the space plane we're talking about. The U.S. Air Force space plane. This is the older photo. So it's the U.S. Air Force. It's U.S. Space Force now. 
And this is the United States Space Force USS F-52, also referred to as the Orbital Test Vehicle, OTV-7, will be the fourth flight of the second Boeing X-37B, an American unmanned vertical takeoff landing and horizontal landing spacecraft. So it takes off on a rocket and then it lands horizontally like a normal airplane, kind of like the space shuttle. Like think of it as a smaller space shuttle, but it doesn't launch like a space shuttle. It launches in, launches in a fairing of a, of a rocket. So uh, it'll be launched into low Earth orbit aboard a Falcon Heavy rocket for the first time from LC-39A, um, December 2023. Space plane is operated by the Department of the Air Force Rapid Capabilities Office in the United States Space Force. So this is a little bit of background here. And, you know, there's not much information. So I'm going to give you what we know. Uh, the OTV-7 will be the fourth mission uh, in the seventh X-37B mission overall. It will be flown on a Falcon Heavy in the expendable center core, recoverable side cores configuration, and launched from Kennedy Space Center 39A. It will be the second classified flight of uh, Falcon Heavy awarded in June of 2018 and is valued of about $130 million. So this is awarded in 2018, and they're just getting around to launching this thing. Um the second one is uh, it increased to 149.2 million in August of 2021 due to a change in the contract requirements and expected to be completed by uh, April 14th. Uh, draft solicitation said the launch was um, 14,000 pounds to GTO a month before launch. The Air Force announced that the mission will fly an X 37B space plane. So, as of right now, we don't know a lot about this. There's a solar array. It shows over here that there's a solar array. Um, and then that's pretty much it. We we have some information about some things that may be part of this plane. But like I said before, we know that they have some Earth observation um, equipment on board and possibly uh, they're observing some satellites up there, too. So that's all we know. Like this is a very special space plane, very special top secret space plane. So we don't really know much about it. Unfortunately, you know, we don't know much about this space plane, but it will be launching on a Falcon Heavy, uh, SpaceX's uh, most powerful fully operational rocket. And apparently, once they uh, they do the Starship launches and they can configure that properly, maybe a USS F-50 something else may be able to launch on a Starship in the future. It has a big enough cargo uh, area that this could happen. So that would be absolutely amazing. So that's it for now. I just want to give you a quick brief before they launch this thing at 8.07. I think it's 8.07 tonight. Yeah, 8.07 p.m. Eastern time. So I just want to give you a quick briefing, how to watch it, where to watch it. You can watch it on X at the SpaceX um, handle, or you can watch it in numerous places on YouTube. So check it out. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.